In this video, we will discuss self-treatment of the lumbar and thoracic paraspinals. These muscles go all the way up and down the back, beginning here at the crest of the hip and then attaching onto the thoracic ribs and ending at the level of the shoulder. Treatment of these muscles is helpful to augment treatment of headaches as well as low back pain. This is due to the tension these back muscles are able to induce on other tissues in the body, in the neck, as well as the low back. Pain from the paraspinals in the thoracic spine may refer pain into the shoulder blade here and straight through to the chest. And that trigger point is located right about here, and it's in the second band of paraspinals that come up. The lumbar paraspinals can also refer pain into the mid-buttock by compressing the trigger point located right at the base of the ribs. I'm going to show Erica how to self-treat a trigger point in her right thoracic paraspinals. Again, those long muscles that run along either side of the spine from just between the shoulder blades to the lower back. Follow this basic protocol when using the back knob or two on any muscle and refer to the back knob or two user guide if necessary. Self-treatment of the paraspinals begins by using the larger curve of the back knob or two tool to reach around the body. Notice how Erica keeps her arms close to her body in a position that is comfortable for her. After we've treated our lumbar paraspinals, then we're going to be moving up into the thoracic paraspinals. When we get here, keep in mind that the thoracic paraspinals actually come off a little bit more to the side, so we can augment our treatment by sliding the back knob or off to the side a little bit more to catch those muscles. We can then continue uh, treating up the spine up until we get to be about the level of the mid-scapular region. At that point, we can take the back knobber and, and for Erica's size, we can use the smaller hook of the back knobber to reach around from the front and then continue our treatment up towards the level of the shoulder. Also keep in mind that as you find any tender spots or trigger points, to apply pressure for about 8 to 20 seconds until you feel that pressure release. Thank you.